Do you love me? Do you love me not? Damn, you hit the spot. I'm stepping. Pro artist status, so them other bitches mad at her. Too mad at her. Fuck, I was playing with anyways. Take my wrist, bottom the drip, my jewelry sick. Uh, Talking shit, but they still ain't saying that. It's circulated. It's time to circulate. What I do, my team? Money fight. These niggas Hey y'all, hey, it's your girl Shay and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I will be filming a Shein try on haul. I will be showing you guys a couple pieces that I have picked up. I picked up these items, I'm not gonna lie to you, a couple months ago, but I'm just now refilming this video because I didn't like how my last one turned out and I just wanted to show you guys what I got because a lot of these items I still haven't worn yet. So I figured why not, you know? A lot of these pieces that I got are very simple, but simple being that you can either dress them up or dress them down or pair them with something else in this haul or maybe in your closet to you know spice up an outfit all the items will be down below as well as the sizing don't forget to like comment and subscribe as well as share it with your friends and family so we can all be a part of the family and without further ado let's get right into the video so the first item that i got is this two-piece set it's just this black oversized cropped sweater and these black shorts first thing i will say about this set is that it is very see-through thankfully i do have dark undergarments under but um i did try this on before with undergarments that weren't dark and you could see literally almost everything yeah so this is how it looks on I really like this set but just because of the fact that it is see-through I'm not too sure how I feel about actually wearing it outside in public. The shorts itself are high-waisted. It's very stretchy so there's a lot of room for you know if there's bigger girls or if you gain weight in the future. Um, I really do like this sweater though even if you don't wear it with the shorts this is something that you can just throw on and go to the store i like how the arms are a bit more looser than the shirt but i really do like this two-piece set it's really cute very comfortable something you can wear around the house or go run errands in but that just depends on your comfortability like i said i don't know if i would be able to but honestly it's really cute i like it it makes my body look good and it just makes me feel cute so this next item is just this black bonsai zippered top and i think it's really cute and very simple but you can dress it up or down it has silver detailing going across the chest that you can either zip up or down to however you'd like it to be and it's just very simple but you can like literally make it however you'd want texture is very nice in this the sleeves and the whole shirt itself is very stretchy so the next item i got are these black leather pants i really like these pants i actually wore them already so these pants they make your body look so good like i really like these pants they're very nice material obviously they're gonna make some noise because they're leather but they're not gonna be too noisy the thing i like about these ones is they're not a shiny type of leather material they're kind of like a matte black and it's just like a little bit of shine but not too much where it looks like glossy only thing that i don't really like about these pants is that on the thigh area it has this lining where it makes me look like my legs are sausages in my opinion i don't know but um i don't really like that lining it really could have just been a regular pant um going all the way down i didn't really notice that on the model probably because she wasn't you know as thick as i am but nonetheless i really like it so this next item is this leather crop top and i really 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 love this top this top like makes me feel like a bad bitch like <laughs> yeah that girl period let me just do an overview like excuse me <laughs> your man i took him no excuse me like this top right here is literally a showstopper um it actually looks really good with these pants on i actually just left them on just because and i really like them together it's giving oh uh, it's giving it's giving a lot 
I don't know what it's giving. I usually have a saying for something, but is giving i just don't know exactly what and nonetheless it's just this leather crop top it has these strings that can be tied and the strings are actually very long i just tied it so it can just hang a little bit on you know my legs i don't really have a choice but i really like the structure of this shirt i do wish it was a tad bit tighter maybe but nonetheless it's still really cute i do have it on with a strapless bra just because i already had it on you don't need a bra with it because honestly the bra is gonna show as you can see so i wouldn't recommend wearing a bra unless like you know you have another technique i really like this this is really a 10 out of 10. this next item is this two-piece set i'll start off with the cardigan first so the cardigan is super long and i really like this actually it makes me feel like somebody's mother a housewife I don't know it just gives me such like casual vibes that i love it it goes all the way down and it's very cozy and thick it's thick enough to keep me warm during the colder winters um in florida south florida but also not thin enough where i'm gonna be super hot as well so it's literally like right in the middle it's very good quality it's gonna really keep me warm i like really want to make an emphasis on that um and i really like this color of the gray gray is one of my favorite colors even if i don't pair the cardigan with this outfit specifically it'll go with a lot of things so i really like that so the next part of it is just this gray bodysuit so i really like this bodysuit actually i just believe that i should have got it in a size down and the reason i say that is because in this area and like on my thighs it is pretty loose but at the same time since i do have a gut and you know i'm not like the skinniest person you would be able to see everything if I did go size down. So like, I feel like I got the right size, but at the same time, I feel like I didn't. So like, I'm kind of conflicted. I don't really know, but nonetheless, I really like this. This has literally the same quality as the cardigan. It's super, it's not super thick, but it's not thin either. It does have these um, breast cups. It's not necessarily an underwiring. It's just the actual outlook of it. Um, and my boobs clearly do not go in them. All right, so this next item is this white tank top. It's super simple, but actually really cute because it can really spice up an outfit. It just has this cross detailing in the front with minimal cleavage, which I really like. The material of kind of like a wife beater. The back looks like this. It's very stretchy. The material is really nice, and I just love how one strap is thin and then the other strap is thicker and yeah okay so this next item is similar to the last one literally except one strap is obviously not as thick and i really like this um i got these shirts really because you know summertime is coming and i needed stuff to wear just to throw on but still be cute and i got it in this orange color i really like this though cleavage is a little bit more deeper than the last shirt this shirt does have adjustable straps unlike the last one so if it's not as tight as you'd like it to be you could definitely make it that way perfect for the summertime honestly the color is looks really nice on my skin if i do say so myself but you know that's just me all right so this next item is this gray cropped hoodie which i really really like um it's actually one of my favorite items in this haul because it's super simple but really cute it's really cozy and very warm um perfect for the winter time in areas that's not super cold it's the right amount of crop that it doesn't show your bra so this craft sweater is really cozy and super simple this is a cute alternative to wearing a sweater jacket whatever you want to call it and still looking cute and it doesn't feel as if somebody just snipped it across and just made it cropped like it's stitched here all over the bottom too to give it that cropped look with structure which i really do like so i'll give this a 10 out of 10. all right so this next item is this black and white cropped flannel 
which I really like. I actually really wore it. Um, the reason why I like it so much is because of these strings on the sides. You can really um, make it as cropped as you like. This tank top underneath is from Shein as well. It's just this cropped white feeder tank top. It's really stretchy. It's a nice basic. It just adds to an outfit and so does this cropped flannel it's not super thick but it's not thin either it's not the material of a jacket but it's cute so i got another flannel this flannel is more neutral in my opinion it's this brown and navy blue color you could definitely make it cuter by tying it up a little bit like this you know rolling the sleeves up To give it that extra look if you don't want to wear it just as a regular flannel however you'd like a lot of times fashion is what you make it and you know you just have to make pieces however you'd like it to be you know itself is basically just like the black and white ones as far as the um, material of it it's not thick it's not thin but it's definitely pretty structured i like that it's long enough to cover my butt i don't know what i'm gonna wear exactly with it but i really like it I have one more flannel. This one is kind of different. Well, not kind of, it is different. Well, this one is more oversized. I actually believe I should have gotten this one a size down from the size that I did get it, but it's fine anyway. I really like this because it is so different. One side is black with the flannel pattern on the chest area and on the sleeve, and then it's the opposite on the other side, which I think is very creative and the back is just plain black which gives it a balance not too much i would only get it a size smaller because the sleeves are so big and i am pretty small so if i got it a size smaller it would still be big but not as big as it is so this side as you can see is cuffed and this one is not um being that this one isn't cuffed it makes it look way more bigger but i just wanted to show you guys the differences um for my size in itself i am 5'3 so one of my other favorites in this haul is this black sweater and i really like it just because it's so simple and because it's black i love black on me it just looks super sleek i don't know so it just says los angeles california it's not like an actual sweater material it does keep me warm i will say but um i don't really know how to explain the material to be honest but it's just not the but it just feels literally like light and airy a lot of people might like that but i want my sweaters to feel more like a thicker material and structured material this one doesn't feel that way it's really cute i'll give it that it's giving like college girl campus hbcu like this you can make this really cute on campus with a nice bag and if you wear sneakers you could wear some ones or some dunks some yeezys like you could really just look really cute with this the next item i got is this super cute i want to say auburn burnt orange top i really like this top it's very different it has this cut out in the middle and it just shows just enough skin at the top it just has enough where it's not doing too much but it's doing just enough this would be perfect for a date night or just to go out and get drinks with your friends i haven't really seen a lot of shirts like this and i really do like this the material is very stretchy so this next item i got is so cute it's just this v-neck black crop top it just outlines my features so well if you don't want to show as much this shirt definitely gives you the option, you know, of moving the lining of the shirt to be more conservative. Me personally, I will not. That's just me. And the shirt fits super snug. So like I said, it's going to definitely show your features really well. You can dress this one up with jeans on like I have on now with some heels. Or you can dress it down with some sandals, however you'd like. It's just super casual, but super cute. This next item I got is this green tie-dye shirt, and I really like it. I don't have anything like this in my closet, especially this color, which I really do like. I just tied it up in the front to give it um, an extra look to it, but if you don't want to, 
It looks just as good as a regular shirt. Well, this shirt is very soft, I will say. It's really nicely structured and I like that. So, I mean, it's just a shirt. I don't really know how you can mess up a shirt's quality. So, this next item is a two-piece jogging set and it's in this velvet material, which is super soft. I really, really like this set. Only thing I will say, I don't know where I was going with this color. The color is kind of throwing me off. I don't know if it's my hair or what, but the color is definitely throwing me off right now. But other than the color, I really like how this material looks just as good as it feels. Um, it feels super nice and it's super stretchy as well, especially in the waistband. So if your waist is just, you know, a bit bigger than mine, you have more than enough room to fit into it same thing for the bottoms as well it definitely makes your body look super good i think i originally bought this so like as like a travel outfit for you to like wear to an airport or wear for a road trip to be comfortable in the only thing i will say i don't really like is just this like air bubble in this crotch area it's kind of really not flattering i don't know if maybe if i got a smaller size if it would have made it better my problem is with sizing i believe that i feel like i'm bigger than what i actually am so i'd rather get a bigger size than a smaller size i probably could have sized down honestly now that i'm thinking about it this is kind of giving me like juicy couture uh y2k 2000s this would be the perfect outfit for like a 90s 2000s throwback party with some air forces and like the big hoop earrings like this would be so so cute so this next item is this blue mock neck turtleneck dress i really like this dress because how nice it makes my body look and because of this slit on the side like this slit on the side just gives it that extra oomph like how it makes my booty look good and it just makes everything look good like yes i have a stomach whatever we already do that but nonetheless i still look good like it makes my hips look good like Ah, everything looks good like you need this dress you do okay so this next item is this nude ruched dress i don't want to not like it but i don't like it i tried this on before and the first time i absolutely hated it but now i don't absolutely hate it i just don't really like it if that makes sense I just feel like it doesn't really flatter my body as much as I thought it would. I think it might flatter my body more if I got it tighter maybe. But yeah, I just personally don't feel like it flatters my body much as much as it should. Usually when you buy things that are ruched, like it accentuates your features as far as like it makes your hips look bigger and like it makes your booty look bigger too, which I think it does justice in the back but in the front not so much i think maybe i would like it more if this was going straight across for one and this plunge i'm not really feeling this plunge too much i don't know what could be done but i personally don't really like it i i don't know i really do want to like it i think the dress itself is pretty cute but on me not so much I don't know, maybe I'm going crazy, but it's just not the one for me. Okay, so this next item is this bodycon dress. I can't even tell you much about it because it's just already giving. Like, it's already telling you how it feels on me. Like, yeah, whatever she said because she's doing it. I really like this dress. It's a mini dress. It literally makes my features on my body look very nice only thing i don't like about it is this side has no type of support or structure i already know like as the night would go like i would be fixing this side up literally like every two seconds because it just naturally just falls nonetheless i really do like the dress i would just have to be really careful about where i wear it too because like i said i would have to be adjusting myself a lot during the night i really do like it though honestly like i said it's just 
the support area for me so the very last item i got are these boots i've really been wanting some boots for a really long time like for some years now but i just never got any so they're these just really long and knee-high boots with a slight heel on them i think they're so cute i have not worn them yet they just look like this it's a very smooth texture and it just laces up in the back and I really like these, super cute. I can't wait to wear them, honestly. I don't know where I'm gonna wear them. I actually was gonna wear them for Halloween, but and then I'm buying them after Halloween, just because I think they'll be perfect in the winter time for when I go back to school. And yeah, I love them. All right, so that is all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this Shein and Try and Haul and were able to find some things that maybe you can add to your closet. Let me know down below which item was your favorite or which item you felt looked best on me. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and turn on your post notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a video because we are coming. It's 2021. We're literally almost halfway through the year. And, you know, I couldn't be happier with how the year is going so far. And I hope you guys feel the same. If you have any suggestions on what you would like to see from me, let me know down below or in my DM. And don't forget to follow me on all my social medias. And yeah, see y'all in my next video.